Hi there, I'm Penny Kerbel, your North Myrtle Beach Realtor, and I help buyers find their perfect next home and sellers find their perfect buyer. Hi there, it's Penny Kerbel, your North Myrtle Beach Realtor, here to take you on another North Myrtle Beach, or in this case, a Little River community tour. This week's tour takes us through an eclectic neighborhood, which has always been a favorite of mine. We'll get started in a minute after my short break, and then we'll get into why I love this neighborhood. Windjammer Village is definitely one of a kind, and I have loved its eclectic collection of homes since I first drove through it years ago. I honestly could never guess how many homes are in the neighborhood because there are so many of these homes tucked away up hills and in courts in this heavily tree community. So I had to ask. After you enter the gated community, you can see many styles of homes from the one story to the multi-story, traditional and the ranch style, to the occasional mobile home that could be replaced with a detached home someday in the future. I just love the element of surprise when you drive around a corner and see one lovely home after another. According to the Windjammer Neighborhood HOA, there are 383 homeowners here, of which 273 are full-time residents. Windjammer is located along the ICW or Intercoastal Waterway, just off of Highway 179 and a stone's throw from the South Carolina State Line. Convenient to Calabash and Little River because of the country vibe and feeling you get driving through the community, you would not believe that it is so convenient to North Myrtle Beach entertainment and shopping. As we're driving through the neighborhood, please take the opportunity to see all the home styles. And maybe like me, you can embrace the eclectic nature of this gated community. Community features include a pool, tennis courts, security of course, clubhouse with recreation facilities, boat dock, and boat ramp. The small HOA fee covers community facilities. In the last 12 months, Eight two-bedroom homes sold for an average price of $201,906, and that's a bargain in Little River. Of the eight three-bedroom homes which sold, the average price was $241,250. And finally, two four-bedroom homes sold for an average price of $275,000. Yes, there are no debts and fixer-uppers, which with vision, you can turn into a lovely home. Hope you enjoyed something a little different this week. See you again with next week's tour. And in the meantime, please contact me with questions about North Myrtle Beach and Little River real estate. If you liked this video, you might wanna watch this one next. <laughs>